Hi guys, hi girls, welcome back. It's brilliant to be back as well. I feel fresh. I've had a week away in Morocco, my wife. Got some brilliant videos done on here. If you want to check them out. Right, today, let's get back to what we're doing now. I've been shopping. I've been to farm foods. And I bought air fryer meals, kebab meat with chips and virachin sauce. I can't even pronounce that. It was £2.49. Bigger portion, better value. Kebab meat with chips and... Sriracha sauce, I think that's spelled right. Special kebab meat slices with crinkle cut chips and a hot and spicy blah 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 chilli sauce. Now that's a picture on it. Looks quite nice. 17 minutes from frozen, I can do it in the oven. Contains a sachet of hot and spicy chilli sauce. 450 gram pack. So look at that guys. I've had a few of these, these meal bags for air fryers the last, last few months. Right, to air fry from frozen, until they cut the chips into the fryer drawer and cook at 200C for approximately 17 minutes. Remove kebab meat from packaging and add to the chips after 12 minutes and cook for the final 5 minutes. Be careful not to overcook the kebab meat. Frequently shake in drawer or turn in with silicone tongs. Remove product from drawer and stand for 1 minute and serve. Caution, take care when titling, tilting drawer as the grill plate may move. Do not touch drawers during off during and for some time after use it is it gets very hot and hold and hold by the handles right so your ingredients i'm not going through these ingredients guy there's absolutely everything in here anyway if you want to pause it feel free to do so right like i say it's a 450 gram pack your allergen advice typical values per 100 gram your energy is 771.58 kj 184.29 k cal your total fat is 10.51 gram of which saturates 3.96 gram your carbohydrates is 15.58 gram of which sugars 1.41 gram your protein is 6.80 gram and your salt is 1.40 gram right you do this, oh, you do this sauce on ob. open, unopened sachet in a pan of boiling water, simmer for five, five to four to six minutes from frozen. Let's stand right. Like I say, you do my oven as well, guys. We're doing ours in air fryer. We're not messing the bar. Let me get your stir up and we'll have a look inside this bag. Right. So two pound forty nine. It's not in the world, is it? It's not going to let me open it, so I'll come back to you in a minute and get some scissors. There you guys. I'll tell you again now, I've got some scissors. Look at this sauce. So your sauce is like a big pack. And you've got to do it, you've got to make it warm. Right. Let's get over to Ninja. So it says do chips first, didn't it? Oh right, so you can have me it comes in another bag. That's convenient, isn't it? There's lots of kebab meat that you like. But anyway, let's get chips in first. And we'll move forward from there. I forgot how many says the chips for. Let's have a look at bag again. It says do for 17 minutes, but that's from Fosden. These have I've actually the first took them out this morning, so. I'll do them at 10 first and we'll have a look at it after. They're done now guys, so I'm going to make a bad meat. I think that's how you do it. Restart it. Ready now, that guys. Yeah, it's looking good. Looks good. Put you all here. I'm not going to put it all out because there's too much to be honest. But I will. Try to Apologise. That 
Was geht es weiter? Na, wir gehen weiter. Ja, ich habe ein bisschen Sonne Pepperon, guys. Just to test it. Oh, I forgot my sauce as well, isn't it? Well, I can't pronounce. Right, guys. Let's get out of the table and test this bitch. Review this bitch, should I say. Test it. Hey, so one pound, sorry, what do you want? It was two pound forty nine. So, let's try chips first. Crinkle cut chips. Look all right, there's quite a lot of chips weight actually. Hmm. They're quite nice. I'll try it with some sauce. Hmm. That sauce is nice. Also, what I did yesterday, <clears throat> I got back uh, Sunday night from holiday. So yesterday morning, went to pick my mum and went shopping. I went to Farm Foods in Iceland. I didn't know Farm Foods had a one pound aisle. I've got some pizzas and a few more bits and bobs to try out. So not only Iceland's got a one pound aisle, Farm Foods has as well. This sauce is quite nice. Mm. Chips are as well. Hey, kebab mate. It doesn't taste too bad, it's not it's not what you get from a kebab shop though, let's be honest. No, it's not. Let's try chips and kebab meat together. See if that makes a difference. In sauce. That kebab made them do it for me. Looks like a lover. No. Don't like that kebab meat at all. That chips are nice and that sauce is really nice. I'm a fair bit kebab. Don't forget to miss. So, anyway. Um, Like I said guys, Billy to be back. We'll get back into these four reviews. Uh, I'm not going away now while January to Barbados, but let's go full steam with these four reviews for now. 
Right, packaging wise, it's a, it's a bag, it's all clearly marked out what's what, how to do it, how to cook it, blah blah blah. Price wise, £2.49. It's not going to break bank, is it? But I won't buy, be buying this again because that, that kebab meat is it's horrible. The chips are nice, sauce is nice, kebab meat is a no no. So, all in all, I'm going to give it a six. If you want to try it, try it by all means. Please leave your comments below what you think about it. But for me personally, it's a no. Uh, I'll get a six, that's all. And that, that's me being generous, getting a six. Anyway, feel free to subscribe, guys. Please like, share, subscribe. Uh, it means well to me. You know that we've gone through this countless times. Hit that subscribe button, and I shall catch you in the next one.